concerned about where our data is stored and who has access to them. My guest on the show today is the CEO of a tier 3 data center who shares his thoughts on a number of issues. Our tech tip is on ways to fix Bluetooth pairing issues. We have quite a lot lined up for you, but first, some tech news and updates. I'm Chukomeka Agbata. Welcome to the show. Children are naturally born explorers and creative thinkers, constantly exploring the world around them. Many experts in education and technology believe that exposure to STEM needs to start at an early age so children can discover and build on those hidden talents in them. A Lagos-based STEM center, Creative Builders Club, is doing this, providing hands-on approach in the teaching of science, technology, engineering and mathematics in schools. Technology has become the forefront in the educational system in Nigeria now because um, the trend of um, profession and career is beginning to change in um, um, our society now. A lot of children are becoming um, critical thinkers, they're beginning to explore more the curiosity to discover and find out what's happening in their environment is becoming on the rise. So um, with technology from uh, uh, the childhood stage, I think that um, children tend to learn in a more advanced um, environment, being able to um, design critically, think beyond the normal perception of what the children should know. But they aren't just taking STEM learning to schools as a subject, but also as an extracurricular activity. They use LEGO resources as an educational enrichment program to enable the children provide solutions, build imaginations, explore, investigate and broaden their horizons. For an effective result, the instructors teach the children in groups based on their ages. Young builders for the three to five year olds, early inventors for the five to eight year olds, and techie builders for those within the ages of eight and 15. While I was teaching some years back, I, I've always worked with children for, for a while now and I used to gather things a lot, wanting to let them know more than the normal things I teach them in class. So I used to read up a lot on how to reinforce learning in the classroom. And I found out that um, using science, technology, engineering and math, you can actually teach so many things. You can teach social studies in it, you can teach geography, you can teach mathematics, you can teach vocabulary skills and so many things. So I found out that there are so many children who are kinesthetic learners, children who love to touch and learn. Um, a lot of us would ordinarily hear and forget and most times what you see and you remember because it sends a representation in your mind. But most importantly, the hands is the tool to man's intelligence. So what you hear automatically interprets in your brain and it doesn't, it, it hardly leaves you. So in the past, I always teach my children by touching what I want them to learn. And it goes a long way to making them remember as time goes on. Children are extremely curious and impressionable. 
So Neka and her team try to instill an interest in them at an early age to spark a lasting desire to pursue a career in any field. We've learned how to build, create and program using high-tech technologies and we make use of things like Cosmos and Lego resources in the building process. And we've also learned how to solve problems, solve problems and solve problems of electricity and how to make use of alternative ways to produce electricity such as the solar power and remote control and air and water power. I learned how to be imaginative and creative. I, I learned of alternative sources like energy, solar energy, electrical energy, water, energy, water and air. Water power and air power. A kinetic energy sailboat, a solar powered race car, a Lego robotics ultrasound sensor, an elevator, and an air water power propeller plane are some of the things created by the children. Products of their innovative thinking and imaginations are proof that they can become inventors, solution providers, and indeed get into any profession they so desire.